Hello and welcome to Spoken English Video Lessons by Arrow Publications. I'm your Spoken English Trainer Padmini and in today's video lesson we will be talking about some words related to travel. When we travel to different places for different purposes, there are some words that we can use to describe the journey. The first word that we would be discussing is picnic. What is a picnic? A picnic is a place we go to and have a meal there, a packed meal. You can go to a park or a field or to any place in your city where you spend time with your family or your friends with a packed meal outdoors. So this is what a picnic means. The second word is an excursion. Excursion is generally a journey that's outside your city or town. It's a short journey by a group of people. An excursion is also called a jaunt. The next word is trip. A trip is generally a journey. It refers to a journey which includes the return. That means you go to a new place and a trip includes even the return from the journey. And the next one is tour. What is a tour? A tour is a journey where you go to different places. You visit different places. It's not just one place like a trip. You visit different places and come back. So that's a tour. And the next one is a cruise. What is a cruise? A cruise is a vacation, a leisurely vacation, a relaxing vacation on a ship. And the next one is a voyage. A voyage is a long journey, maybe on a ship. And when you go abroad, you cross the seas, isn't it? So a journey across the seas is usually a voyage, even on a plane. On a flight. And the next word is expedition. What is an expedition? An expedition is a journey by a group of people for the purpose of research. Generally scientific experiments are conducted during expeditions. A group of scientists go there and they perform some expedition. They do some research on their journey. During the expedition they uh, find out something about different places or the uh, some conditions in that place or maybe the life in that particular place, animals, anything. The next one is a pilgrimage. A pilgrimage is a journey to a holy place or a sacred place. We visit different places of worship like temples, mosques, gurudwaras, and churches and visit to these places in different cities or towns or even different countries is called a pilgrimage. And the next word is a trek. What is a trek? A trek is a difficult journey, a long difficult journey on foot. Some people like to trek on mountains. They also go like to go to different places on foot and that's a long difficult journey. The next word is hitchhiking. What is hitchhiking? There are some people who travel by asking for a lift. They take a vehicle at different places and go from one place to another. And the next one is a sightseeing tour. What is a sightseeing tour? Every city or every place has got some interesting places. So seeing all these places is called a sightseeing tour. The next one is a guided tour. What is a guided tour? A guided tour is a tour that is undertaken by a group of people with a, with a guide. The guide takes them around the different places, particularly historical places. So the guide tells them about the history of the place and he makes it very interesting for the tourists. And the next word travel word next travel word is a package tour what is a package tour a package tour 
is a tour undertaken by a group of people which is arranged by a travel agent. It's a package tour. Everything is planned, pre-planned. Accommodation is planned, the food is planned and where you will go is also planned. It's called a package tour. The next type of uh, journey or travel is called backpack tour. It's also called backpacking. What is backpacking? You just have a single bag at the back and you travel to different places. You stay in inexpensive lodgings and you manage with the just necessary things. You have very clothes, very few clothes in your bag, few things in your bag and you travel. You are a traveler. So a person who goes on a backpack tour is a traveler more than a tourist. He goes to enjoy the different places. The next one is a study tour. What is a study tour? A study tour is generally undertaken by students, college students or school students. Maybe they go for studying some plants or to learn about something and they make observations there. There is one more trip called a field trip. What is a field trip? You visit a particular place and you do experiments and you also make your observations and uh, you actually get information after the field trip from the field trip. Now the last one here is a holiday. Holiday is not just a holiday but here holiday is a trip uh, uh, to a place where a family spends a lot of time relaxing. So you go to a new place or any place for that matter, you go and you spend a few days there and you relax with your family or your friends and you see some places, you have a very relaxed and leisurely time. You enjoy your time. So this kind of a travel is called a holiday. So I'm sure you enjoyed learning all these words related to travel, the different types of journeys that we undertake. And next time, you will surely be able to use the right word at the right time in the right context. Please do like, share and subscribe to our videos. We shall come back with some more beautiful videos for all of you. Thank you for watching. See you soon. Goodbye.